this the place where you buy a fishing license? It sure is. Excellent. What's your name? Paddy O'Callaghan. You don't look Irish. I'm adopted. Can we get through this paperwork, please? Uh, where can I uh, catch the biggest fish possible here at Great Kubo? Here's a real good one just up around the corner here in Caroline Street. Hey, sir, what's your name? It's Patty. Patty O'Callaghan. <laughs> you don't look Irish. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a place to go fishing around here? Fishing? Are you yeah. local? No, definitely well, not. Well, obviously not. You'd know where the best hole is. Yeah, exactly. But we're not supposed to tell. Oh, that's... Because the fish are so big up there. Well, they're, they're called Chiswellian loud flappers. Okay. Three doors down on Caroline. What? Hi, I'm Patty O'Callaghan. I know I don't look Irish. I'm adopted. I want to fish for the biggest thing there is in, in, uh, here in Creemore. Is this the place? Listen, Mr. O'Callaghan, you can't approach this fish without the proper training and resources and equipment. It's a squalus and it's feeding time. Unless you want to become a gourmet meal for the fish, you better back off while you still can. Hey, just take it easy. I just want to go fishing. Come with me. Don't touch anything. You've got to be kidding me. We're fishing in a basement? This isn't just any basement. This is a Creemore basement. Tides run high in Creamore, and that's why. This town is in a crisis with the super sump fish. We have brought in authorities. Everyone knows Chief Brody, and to his left, Matt Hooper, a marine biologist, an expert. And yes, it's true, that house on Caroline Street has been shut down. It is closed. Did you so-called experts underestimate the size of this fish? Our fish. She's an orca, all right. You think she can't swim through a five-inch sump line? She'll get to you. And she'll grab a hold of you and look at you with those dark, dead eyes and they'll roll back in the back of her head. You're so terrified you can't even scream. She'll tear you in half. I'll get your fish for you. For $10,000. For that you get the head, the tail, the whole damn thing. Mayor, Chief, ladies and gentlemen. Yes, the swimming with bow-legged women. It's a lively chief. How many horsepower is that? Oh, it's a big one. Get that sells a porker. Stop playing with yourself, Hoover. Get in there. Farewell and do all your fair Spanish ladies. Farewell and do all your... Hey, what are you doing here? This place has been closed down by authority of the Creedmoor police. I have to do this. Hey, Hoover, come here. Let me see your hands. Get the city boy hands. You got money all your life. Buy me a sheep shank. Aye, aye, Captain. Hey, who? <laughs> hey, I think I got it. You good Irish lad, Patty, but you don't look it. I know. I'm adopted. <laughs> My grandfather, who was a great man, he was Irish, also adopted. I knew I, I got something from him. I, I, I couldn't place what it was until today. Um, and I knew I needed to come to Creemore and fish for this great fish. But, but how? How did you get it? I'm a fish whisperer. There lies the body of Mary Lee. Died at the age of 103. At 15, she lost her virginity. Not a bad record in this vicinity. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Mm. Mm -hmm. 
Farewell and adieu, my fair Spanish ladies. Farewell and adieu, my ladies I'm of drunk Spain. I'm drunk and I want to go home. I'm tired I and I want to go to bed. bed. I had a little drink, drink about an hour ago and I went, and went straight to my head. Show me the way to go home. I'm drunk and I want to go to bed. I had a little drink about an hour ago and I went straight to my head.